created solid models for my stock on my two T-nuts. Now I want to bring the vise in and merge them. Before I do that, I'm going to do several things. I'm going to set the new wireframe color to purple number 5. I'm going to set the solid model cutter, color to blue number 9. And I'm going to create a new level to bring the geometry into. So I'm going to number this level 100. And I'm going to name it vise. So I'll accept this. Now I'll come up to my file, merge pattern, navigate to where I have saved my solid model and extracted it. I also have to tell it the file type is the SolidWorks assembly. So I'm going to come over here to the all files and I'm going to scroll through until I find SolidWorks for solid part and solid assemblies. I see everything. I want the assembly, so I'll select the assembly. I'll go to Options next. I'm going to tell it to turn on edge curves. They will be purple because I've set the current color to purple. I'm going to tell it to import solids. And for scale, I want no change. The part was created in inch and I want it to stay in inch. I'll accept these settings. I'll tell it to open the part. I'll fit the screen. And we can see how they've merged. Okay. These entities should be on level 100. So there are 919 entities currently on level 100. I'm happy with everything. I don't want to change the scale or rotation. I'll accept that. I will have to move my vise and possibly my G55 nut over to this edge. But for now, we've merged the two parts. I want to save my work.